Hello guys and today we'll be checking out the WooCommerce Delivery Boy app that basically facilitates the web store admin as well as the delivery uh, guys both as it builds a link between them through the tracking and chat, chat facility. Now the admin using the mobile application can assign orders on the move to the respective available delivery guys and the delivery guys can accept or reject the orders as required. So I'll be taking you through the workflow of this particular WooCommerce Delivery Boy mobile application from on the Android device today. So I'll be installing the uh, app from the Google Play Store today and I'll be showing you the workflow thereafter on the admin's end as well as on the delivery guy's end. So, uh, so uh, we'll be seeing how the customer can place the order initially then how the admin can check that particular assigned order within his mobile app then how the uh, delivery guy would accept the order will make it as pickup then would uh, navigate to the customer's address through the google maps and how uh, he'll be uh, basically delivering the uh, order after entering the uh, one-time password for the verification so as to make the order as delivered so all of this uh, will be shown to you on the mobile end but before that let me take you to the storefront wherein the customer first places the order and according to that particular order we'll be checking the rest of the functionality of this particular plugin and before proceeding further please do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates apart from that if you find this particular video helpful then kindly do give it a thumbs up so let's hop on to the storefront first and then we'll check the admin and the delivery boys mobile application for the rest of the flow there so i'm at the storefront right now so i'll be logging into my customer account and i'll be placing one order thereafter so let me go to the orders section so let me place this uh, same order the order number 107 that i've already uh, placed so uh, let me order it again so let's uh, make a check out uh, thereafter now so there are okay so everything is good to go and let me place the order now and after placing the order uh, we'll have the uh, one-time delivery under the order details there and after this i'll just take you to the uh, admins end to show you how this particular order pops up uh, onto the mobile end of the admin and the rest of the flow thereafter all right the order has been placed uh, let's check uh, the order details orders so it is the order number 110 let me view the order and here's the OTP that needs to be provided by the customer to the delivery guy when he's, uh, he has arrived at the customer's destination to uh, make the order as delivered. So now let's hop on to the admin uh, mobile application for the further uh, workflow there. So here I'm at the mobile end and I've uh, my Android device and I've installed the WooCommerce Delivery Boy uh, app as you can see on the device itself. So uh, let's uh, log into the app. So as soon as I tap in, you can see this plus screen for the Delivery Boy app. And here's the login section. So I'll be logging in as the admin first, and then I'll be showing you the rest of the flow at the Delivery Boy uh, end as well. So both the admin and the Delivery Boy can make use of the same single app. So uh, let's tap here on the login button. So we have placed one order with the order number 110. So after the login, we should have uh, that up within the app itself. So we have logged into the app and uh, actually what happens is that as soon as the order is uh, placed at that very moment, if the uh, admin is logged in, he can see a uh, push notification for the same. Now on the left hand uh, side panel, if you can see here, the admin is logged in and he has different options here like dashboard, orders, delivery boy and chat so under the orders he'll uh, find all of the orders that are uh, let's go to the orders first let's see what uh, are there so here we can see the all orders and here's our order number 110 under all, all orders then we have the assigned then we have the unassigned now coming back to the orders here you can see that we have the order number 110 we can view the details there's a cap that was purchased uh, by the uh, customer and here are the details of the order itself now here at the top uh, you can see that we have the option to choose a delivery boy so if i tap on that 
that will bring up the complete list of uh, delivery boys that are available right now so you can see that one of the delivery boys is uh, available right now and uh, he already has five orders there and from here the admin can assign this particular order to this uh, uh, delivery guy so we'll see that particular thing in a moment from now or let's go and uh, let's uh, assign it to that particular delivery boy so you can see that it's uh, processing the same so this uh, delivery boy would be assigned with the order number 110 so you can see order assigned successfully and here you can see delivery boy is John Doe uh, that's John Doe there so let's go back so that's how uh, the admin can uh, assign a, a delivery boy to a particular order uh, let me do one thing in the back end in the or the, on the storefront let me paste one more order to show you the push notification that comes in because we were not able to see that initially so let's go back and uh, let me place the order at the uh, storefront so as soon as the order gets placed there we'll find one uh, push notification here for the same that uh, an order has been placed so just give me a second for that so you can see this that a new order number 111 has been placed we already had the order number 110 so when you are logged in you will get definitely the push notifications will come to you so now we have assigned the uh, order to the uh, delivery guy and uh, we'll be checking that end as well so let me first con complete that part first and then we'll see the rest of the options as well uh, so under the orders we have the all of the orders we can assign the delivery boys uh, uh, to the particular orders now under the delivery boy here uh, we'll find a complete list of delivery boys that are available right now and to add a new one we can tap on the add button at the bottom right hand corner and then brings up the section wherein you can uh, enable or disable a particular uh, delivery boy choose the vehicle type whether he's a car cycle uh, ship bus motorcycle whatever is there uh, the details of the vehicle are there his uh, latitude longitude and the full address so you can create a delivery boy using the uh, mobile app itself now uh, after that you have the chat option now from here you can chat with the delivery guys so uh, what I'll do is I'll just chat with uh, John Doe who, uh, John Doe whom I've just assigned one order order number uh, 110 uh, hello uh, John just process the order assigned okay and I'll just send it out now with this message I'll then show you at the uh, at the uh, delivery boys end as well so let's go back so that's the chat functionality as well now the admin can also track the uh, delivery boys for example if I go to the dashboard here then under here I'll find the delivery boy number six right now I believe who's available and online right now that's the John Doe himself so you'll be able to track uh, the location of your uh, delivery boy using the app itself and rest you can check the sales and here you have the uh, graph for your orders as well and here uh, you can check the pending orders processing and the completed orders as well now let's hop on to the delivery guys uh, login so now let me uh, enter the login info for the delivery guy and I'll then tap here on the login button so you can see that we have logged in and we need to provide some access uh, while using the app allow okay so here you can see that we need to enable our gps let's go back so here's the order number 110 that we had assigned there okay my battery is also low never uh, no issues with that let's continue with the video so here you can see that uh, my order i've received order number 110 so i can accept or i can reject the same now the thing is that as soon as i accept it the admin will get a notification or the push notification for the same so uh, don't uh, worry about that as i've already shown you the push notification so i'll have to again log into the admin so i don't have two mobile devices so that i can show you the same at the same moment so let's accept this one and let's process the order let's see how it can be processed for more details you can check our user guide and the live demo as well from the play store and from the ios uh, store as well and uh, thereafter you can check the same to clear any uh, doubts that you have and you can see that the request has been processed successfully now i'll just open the side panel here's the delivery boy himself now if i go to the order section 
here I can see that I've accepted the order number 110 at the very top to view the details I can tap on that and this is the particular details there here we have uh, the customer details Maria Webkul. we have a uh, location as well his uh, her contact number and at the bottom you can see that the uh, order status has changed from processing to accepted and uh, the payment would be upon the uh, cash on delivery there and at the very end we have two options picked up and reject order so the delivery guy can reject the order as well now if he has picked up the uh, order from the admin's uh, pickup location then he'll choose it as picked up and then he'll have to confirm it by tapping ok now another uh, pop of notification at the same time would be sent out to the admin as well onto his mobile device that uh, the particular order has been picked up and then uh, the process for the delivery would start by the delivery guy so I'll just show you that in a second so the order has been picked now at the top you can see that this status is pick up if I go back you can see it's accepted right now that's come going back into the order it's picked up right now and here uh, at the bottom you can see two options one is deliver and the reject order now after pickup now what I can do is I can uh, now navigate to the customers address and at the delivery time I'll tap on the deliver option at the bottom so right now uh, you can tap here on the uh, navigation icon and just tap on that and we need to choose the application that we want to use it opens a google map as you can see and it would uh, bring up the uh, directions for the customer's address so in a just in a second and i can tap here on the directions option from my location your location and you can see it will show the actual uh, one so this is how the customers how the delivery guy can reach the customer's address using the google maps there and then he'll have to tap on the start option uh, to start the navigation and he'll be navigated to the particular uh, customer's address now after reaching the address there let's go back to the uh, mobile end so you'll have to tap this navigation icon choose the navigation and uh, then directly tap on the start and you're good to go to reach the customer's address now after reaching the customer's address uh, for example uh, when I've reached the address what I'll do is to deliver the uh, order I'll tap here on the deliver option now we need to collect 26 rupees here in cash from uh, the uh, from the customer after receiving the cash I'll tap here on the paid then I'll ask the customer for the OTP that he has received after he has placed the order so I'll just enter the same 820543 and then we'll tap here on the proceed button and you can see that the order has been delivered successfully and that's what I can see from the uh, notification at the bottom and here also you can see that the order status changed from pending payment to processing there and uh, now the uh, agent can enter any comment if you want and he can submit a comment as well for example delivered and received payment and then he can tap here in the submit con submit button and you can see that uh, John Doe delivered and received the payment and the right now at the top you can now see that uh, the amount for 26 one items and the status right now is uh, completed so that's how easily uh, can the delivery guy receive the uh, orders from the admin using the mobile app how the admin can track him as well from the back end so uh, for more details uh, you can check the user guide as I've already told you and the links for the iOS and for the Android devices for a much better understanding and uh, this is the OTP that we just entered there uh, while uh, making the delivery by the delivery agent so this is a customer's OTP that needs to be given to the delivery agent at the time of uh, receiving the order itself so that was much about the uh, delivery boy mobile application for the uh, WooCommerce platform based web stores and I hope it helped you out in understanding a bit of how it works if you still have any questions queries suggestions or requirements then can you do reach back to us at support at the rate of webcool.com visit ticket at webcool.com 
or contact us through https colon forward slash forward slash www.webcool.com forward slash contacts. Lastly, if you find this particular video helpful, then do kindly give it a thumbs up. And lastly, thanks for watching the video and have a great day ahead.